Alright, what is up guys? It's your boy Easy Eddie on uh, another episode of the Minecraft Hardcore series. I don't know what episode it is, and I'm not going to pretend to know what it is anyway. So, what we're doing though is we're making my bedroom and furnishing the upstairs of my house. So, what I've already done guys is I have placed, I made a, this cool pattern, I like this pattern, and this is made out of barrels, jungle, or no, dark oak barrels placed reverse so I'd go behind the wall and place them like this and the vice versa for over there and then uh, regular oak planks and I put dark oak in each corner and then we have stone and also I want to show you this little uh, elevator water elevator you just straight up you go you can breathe no worries I think it goes infinitely and then you just come right back down if you want me to show you guys how to make that water elevator, uh, let me know down in the comment section down below. Otherwise, I probably won't make a tutorial on it. Just let me know if you want me to show you exactly how I did it. And then we also put little uh, oak planks up there because I thought that was a cool pattern. But now we are getting into the bedroom portion. So first we're going to do the floor. The floor I have planned out to do smooth stone and... Uh, also, andesite, andes, andesite, yeah, andesite. So I need to use my pickaxe. We'll put that. And the reason I picked this pattern is because the ends of the andesite and the smooth stone they line up really well. So I'll put another one here, and then. We're gonna have to break the whole floor, so I will show you guys. I'll be back right after the pattern's done. Okay, I am back, and here's the floor. The floor has been placed. I like this pattern, I think it looks pretty cool. Oh, and another interesting feature about the barrels in the walls you can store stuff in here. So, if you want to like hide something from your other realm members or just like sneaky or just simply wall storage, you can put it in one of these chests or uh, barrels, I should say. Sorry. But now let's get on to the actual bed portions. Okay, so we got some dark oak planks and uh, dark oak slabs. We're going to put, so this is the middle block. Uh, let's go one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And then I think we can go with a Sorry, let's put the slabs in the back instead of in the front too. So one, two, three. And then we break this, break this, break this. And then we need to make some stairs. So let's make, I think four stairs might do the trick. Putting stairs around the side. Let's make some more. One, two, three, four. Now we need three more. Okay, so there it is. It's made right there. That's the bed frame. So now we're going to put the beds one here and one here. And then in the back, let me think about that for a second. Okay, now welcome back. So I destroyed that wall and I put oak planks. And then I also made, I put smooth stone up there too. I think that kind of looks cool. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to put some item frames up. So we're going to put like a item frame here, 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 here. And then we'll put some cool stuff in there. I haven't decided what I'll put in those yet. The next we're going to make a little end table here. So we do need to do a floor design. So the floor, I think, might as well just be straight up oak, oak planks, because we're going to have carpet on it anyways, so we're going to make the core, the floor oak. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is we are going to put uh, a fence post and a carpet on top of it, so... We need to make fence post. So we need some more sticks. 
All right, we got three. Put the fence post down. Oh, not right there. You want it to be right there. And I take that back. We are going to extend the wall. I don't like how this is looking right there. So we are going to extend the wall further yet again. All right. Welcome back. Okay. So we broke the wall on both sides and we're still going to need to so like where this wall right now is going to be where the next wall is. So we're still going to need to extend it, like break it out and to get another time to place the wall. But for right now we can put our uh, oak planks on both sides and then we can also get our smooth stone and fill in the rest so now that we have the smooth stone filled in I'm gonna put dark oak logs on both sides here I think that will look cool dark oak logs Oopsies. Okay, so dark oak logs have been put on both sides. And now we're going to do we're going to do the ceiling. We're going to break the whole ceiling and replace it with nether quartz. Welcome back. We have done the walls like this. We have the pattern. Now we need to, we're going to put a couple of chests down and we also need to go get some carpet. We have a chest for each side and we need to get carpet to go on top of each of those. I'm thinking white carpet. And we're also going to get items to put in these item frames. Alright, welcome back. So I went and got my stuff that I said I was going to get just a second ago. And I am back. So we have items to put in the item frames. And we're going to do that quick. We're going to see which one looks best. I want to have a diamond in the middle. Emerald. Emerald. The white definitely looks better. And we'll have a, we'll get some torches up in here. We do that quick. So we have torches like that. And then we also got some carpet. Let me get a torch there. A torch there. And now we got some carpet to put on top of the posts. And then we have like a little end table. And now we have carpet to put around the whole thing. The only issue is I didn't have enough wool to make 
all of that I wanted. So, like, I think what I want to do is... Like, I want to have it blue. Like, I like the gray... The gray and blue pattern but I can't do anything with that because I have no more so before we go get more uh, wool go find some sheep and shear them and stuff we're going to put up our lanterns I really love the lanterns in this game they are probably my favorite thing in the game right now and you just hang one right there hang one right there and then we have I think I could even You can put lanterns right up here. They are so cool in my opinion. And I love them. What if I take that torch out? Yeah, we want... Let me see if I like having a lantern there too. Yeah, I do. I love the lanterns. Lanterns are the best thing that in the most recent update, whatever, whenever they came out, I love them. It is beautiful in here now. And now we are going to put a crafting table over right here. And then we're going to put a furnace. right there now I think that's just excellent that is the bedroom the bedroom is finished other than we need to get wool on the floor so I'm gonna go get wool and I'll be right back okay we are back and I have set the beds down this is finished it is done we can get rid of this chest and pick everything up in it. Look at this beauty. Come down the elevator. You drop down. You come in here. Look at the floor. Look at the wall. The patterns. Come up to the beds. The carpet. The chest. Oh my goodness. It looks fantastic. And then if you want to go back up. You just pop up the elevator. Now. It is time to break my bed break this bed break this bed break this bed alright so I have just broken all the beds upstairs and I'm going to go claim my bed down here respawn point is set perfect we go back up and now we need to make some furniture upstairs so in a second we will get into that all right I am back and uh, now so I spent quite a bit of time just working on getting my sheep and wool situation figured out better so I moved the pen and a friend of mine kept killing the sheep so that was a pain in the ass but now here we are this is what we have done this is not I don't think this is going to be final, but this is just pretty good start, and I'm tired and need to go to bed, so I need to finish this episode. But I made a fireplace. I think that looks pretty good. I could add some things to the top, sides. Let me know if you guys have any ideas on what I should add to it. And then I made a couch out of sand sandstone, a little chair with uh, signs on each side, so it makes it look like a chair, which is really just a sandstone uh, staircase stairs. And I made this using slabs in the middle and then stairs on the outside and I put two slabs for like a I don't know what they call the thing but you like to put your feet on it a footrest and then I did a a chair same type of thing as the last time and then a bookcase and a little table right there and then I made a big table and you have to put string so here's how I did it. I had to go up down under and then put this stair on the bottom of the block connect three stairs on both sides and then I put carpet on the top, but then you have to put string underneath in the middle for the carpet to stay up. 
So you do the string first, then the carp, and the string's not very noticeable. And then I put uh, sandstone stairs around it to look like chairs. And then I, uh, I put a little chair down here and a crafting table because I want to have a crafting table somewhere. And then I also put lanterns all over in here, so all the corners right there, right there, light it up a little bit. And that's pretty much all I did as in addition to my bedroom obviously and what I plan to do next is I need to move this whole water thing forward yeah, at least two blocks so I can get maybe three blocks so if I'm one two th one two three put it right here move it forward to here that would be ideal so I could fix the water and looking at the my stuff from my chest room I want to move that so you can't see it and then I might need to put something in the middle. So next episode, I now nah, I can't say that, but eventually I'm going to do this. So if you guys have any suggestions, comments, concerns, or questions, let me know in the comment section down below. Drop a like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.